hi one welcome from acumen accounting how to tell the investments you're going to do is fake or is dodgy so sometime if it looks too good to be true just your ring bells start ringing and you should understand why this is it looks very lucrative and you think you know there's a big opportunity and you're going to be millionaire in like two years time this is not going to be possible it's a long process so if you think that deal is looking too lucrative it means there is must be a scam or it's a fake investment don't go for it because greed is the thing which drives human nature to go and invest into these things and that with that greed you think you're going to have like multi millions or something this is not going to be possible because uh, become a successful it's it it require hard work and time and effort without these old things you won't be able to reach to the, the level where you want it to be so make sure if it's too good to be true don't go for it another thing when you look you know that investment say okay um you the money you, they're asking you to pay it looks too less for example if you're buying um a business or you're investing into one any sort of investments and you think that investment is seems very low uh, what they offering me again that's also a scam um nowadays when people buying a business if you if you are new and you're going into the business there's so many things going around i give you a classic example um one of our clients who bought a business he thought the sales of that restaurant is um it, you know per week is like nearly 50 grand but it was not true what they done is the se- the person who was selling the restaurant they increased the delivery area you know because nowadays you have like just eat uber eat um these are the third party channels where you increase your sales so what they done is they basically increased the delivery um um uh, area from 2 miles to kind of 10 miles so they have the volume of sales coming through but the cost associated with those things that were not been accounted for so the person who was buying the business he was just purely looking at the sales and he thought and he thought the sales looks really good but he didn't spend a time looking into the details where the sales coming from um or how much is just the people sitting in the restaurant and how much is the delivery how much is the collections it didn't break down on these things so from that point when he took over the sales kind of you know when you look at the delivery so look it's impossible to deliver in 10 miles um it takes time going and coming back and you if you have like a couple of delivery drivers they'll be just going out and not coming back so your other deliveries which probably be within 2 mile or 3 mile radius it was unable to deliver and that's giving a negative feedback on the third party um sales channel for don justice and uber eat and on top of that the google's review so he kind of lost in a big way so if you going to buy a business please spend time um sit um with the owners or um get all the information or spend some time on that business because you're spending um quite a large money quite a lot of money into the business and you don't want to be ending up stressing and uh, losing all that cash which you have kind of have you know hard earned money so again if you think these are the situation then again that investment is a scam so one more thing you need to look at uh, when when you uh, going into the investment is if the things um there is in a short term for example let's say okay you give us some money for one year and after after a year you will be it'll be double or triple um there are so many ponzi schemes it was in the past and still going around uh, don't fall into that like for example there's a one coin was the big classic example in the past where so many people have spent thousands of pound i think they this one coin will going to make them like multi millionaire but now they're regretting it because i know some people who have invested in a large sum of money in all these ponzi scheme they think okay the these coins will increase the value will increase um, again some people even lost money in cryptos but crypto is is still some sort of like in kind of you know uh, still there and people think okay um this is which which going to be in future uh, make them but if you have really like lot of money lying around and you're not using it then you can invest in those seas, those sort of things so again make sure when you're investing it looks too good to be true don't invest and if you think the 10 uh, the money they're asking you for the particular investment is seems too less don't go for it and uh, if the Uh, return on your investment is so quick like within a month or two months is going to be double or triple then go for it don't go for it and the ponzi scheme stay away from them um they they offer you so many things but at the end of the day you get nothing um so 
whenever you're investing, please make sure you speak to the professional, um, hang around with the right people who are in the business so you can speak to them. Otherwise, what happens is that at the end of the day, you are going to lose all that money and the investment you have done. Um, especially I've seen people, they have invested with some people. Okay, we'll go in the partnership, do all these things. But at the end of the day, they lost all their money. You must have a bit of experience. If you don't have experience, you need to start hanging around with the right people. I've said that many times. That's very important because if you don't hang around with those people who have the experience and the, the done um, in the past and they can advise you properly. So if you again have any questions or if you want to speak to us, you can just go to our website and book a free appointment or you can leave a comment at the bottom of this video and somebody from our company will definitely get back to you and reply to you. Again, thank you for listening. Stay safe, stay healthy. Bye for now.